all right everybody what's going on and uh welcome to another video um what i'm gonna be showing you guys in this video is uh, my therapy so today i have in total about five hours of therapy and um i go to two different places for it and right now we are at one of the places actually um so for this place i can't show you the inside just because that's one of their rules but the next place where i do the more um like the better therapy is called uh, activity based therapy I'll be able to show you inside, show you the trainers, and show you exactly what I do. Um, so I'm pretty excited just to show you guys, like I said, my therapy and my day, and uh, let's get to it. So the way I'm gonna do it is, since I can't show you guys inside, um, what I'm gonna do is after, ooh, <laughs> afterwards, I'm gonna just tell you guys what I did and uh, describe this place to you a little bit and uh, so you can see the difference between this place and the next place I'm gonna go to. So I will see you guys when I get out. All right, everybody, so I just finished uh, my sessions here at Orlando Health. Um, and what we did was, for the first hour, I went into, um, it's like a, a cognitive therapy room. And what they do is they um, test like, they test how well I do with uh, like math problems and uh, how well my brain is working, basically. Um, so what they had me do today is like a matching exercise, trying to match like uh, colors with shapes and, um, colors with shapes and sizes and try and find uh, matching pairs and I'll uh, see how fast I could do it and how well um, I'm able to pick out patterns and then uh, they had me play for some reason on an Atari and like when they gave it to me how the Ataris were they like remote controls like that, that was it you just connected to the TV and that was it or um no it was an Atari box but now they have that remember I had the Pac-Man one more time uh, okay now they come like that, yeah. Yeah, because she handed me the remote control that said Atari on it, and then we played, like... That's fun. <laughs> I, I kinda, I'm not going to lie. I kind of enjoyed it because it was just so, like, what are we doing? But, yeah. um, and it was it was one of the games on the Atari. I don't know how to exactly explain it, but I played the Atari. Just <laughs> It was like you had a little, like, a, like it was like a paddle on the bottom of the, the screen. <gasps> oh, I know that. Oh, and then you had to hit, yeah. like, the ball and hit the bricks. Oh, yeah. And then it came back. I don't know the name either but I, I know the name yeah well they had me do that and then that was it for that session um and what they've done before is like um had me count money back to them give them change and everything and just you know everything to make sure um that my mind is right so that all this is for the purpose of me getting it back into driving um so i gotta go through all of those courses to get back on the road so then after that um i go and do physical therapy pt and what i did today was um i did curbs like learning how to get for like while in the wheelchair learning how to get um up, up onto a curb or so over a curb again, yeah and so i won't fall um and learning how to get down from a curb from from the wheelchair also what i learned is how to get from the floor ain't no loud how to get from the floor to the wheelchair and um, from the wheelchair to the floor. So things like that, just kind of learning how to maneuver. Uh, so what Orlando Health really is, is, is more like if you go inside, you're gonna think you're kind of like, it's like a hospital setting. They have, you know, everything looks pretty outdated um, and a lot, of the, a lot of their methods are still old. So where we're about to go right now is called, uh, it's called CORE and um, they're more, it's called active, no, activity-based therapy. And what that is, is, uh, is getting your body moving um, and trying to reconnect your mind to like, and trying to reconnect your mind to the rest of your body that's been affected. I wish you guys could see the difference between core and that place because it just shows a lot about uh, what they believe. Orlando Health is more just like trying to um, help you cope with life being in a wheelchair, like trying to, you know, <laughs> teach you how to uh, handle yourself. And they're not really about... Oh, look at that. That's a Ferrari. Mm -hmm. Ooh. That's nice. So these people, um, they they don't mm -hmm. focus completely on recovery. They're just more on, like I said, helping you cope with life and adapt to being in a wheelchair. With, uh, but on, but with core, they're gonna help me really try and uh, recover as much as possible. So when I go there, really my mentality is just to get as you know put as much work in as I can and um, like I trust the exercises that they have me do um, which is trying to reconnect my mind to my body so they're gonna help me as much as I can and then I'll help myself as much as I can and get uh, as close to recovery 
as possible, but whatever I can do, I know God is going to do for me. So, um, so when I look at core, that's what I think. I think of, I think of it as a place that I can work my faith towards recovery. And, you know, I think they're going to, I know that they're going to help me as much as they can. Um, so right now we are on our way over there and it's about a 40 minute drive. So I'm not going to videotape that whole thing. So I will see you guys when I get there. All right, everybody, we are here at Core Therapy, and now I'm gonna show you guys. The first thing we're gonna do is uh, something called Core Fit, and that's like kind of like a CrossFit adapted class, and then I have uh, two hour sessions after that. So I'm looking forward to showing you guys the whole process. How you doing? What's going on, man? morning all right everybody so this is the workout right here lucky seven seven rounds and i'm pretty excited to show you guys how this goes let's put everything on this chair right here it doesn't look that bad what's going on my man huh yeah today today's the day yeah. let's go hit this bag So I had to come into the bathroom um, because I changed my shorts because I had an accident out of nowhere. Um, so, I mean, that's one of the things, that's one of the problems right now is trying to control the bladder. Um, and I mean, it just happened. I didn't even know it until I felt my pants. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to change into these shorts and get back out there. Alright everybody, so I changed my pants, now it's time to go out there, um, I'm pretty sure I missed most of the workout now, but what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go uh, do my my two hour session, and uh, yeah, I'm still putting work, so let's do it. Keep going, keep going. 
It was on dog again.
All right, everybody, so that was core. Um, what I did in the first hour was uh, we did like, it's called a core fit class, which is um, basically just working out the upper body and a little bit of your core, which is like uh, your, uh, your, <laughs> working out the core of your body, like the middle of your body, uh, trying to strengthen all that. And then uh, trying to get a good workout in to stay fit also. For the first training hour I had, I was with a trainer named Annie and um, Cameron. And what they did, they helped me um, like unlock and lock my leg so uh, what you guys seen is like I would do a squat and then using like electrical stimulation um, I would push off like I would try and lock out my legs and I'll go from the squat to full extension and then what we did after that was we would do one leg at a time trying to unlock and lock the leg and that's just trying to focus on uh, just contracting the muscle and it's just trying to like retrain the muscle uh -huh. to be able to do that movement did you do any without the stimulation or did yeah. you do all stimulation? Uh, no, we did some without mm -hmm. and then those went pretty well too. Okay. And then after that hour, we did something called locomotor training, which is um, you just, they strap you up like you guys seen onto a harness and then you go over a treadmill. So what we were working on is going at different speeds and uh, me focusing on trying to, you know, bring my legs forward and trying to get the walking motion. That's what they're helping me out do. No, well, that's, that's what, what they help it, help, it helps you your body remember what it is to walk. Right. Right? Yeah. Because that's what you're doing. So mm -hmm. it's helping your body yeah. retraining the muscles. The body, the mind, everything. The Not body, the, the mind, and yeah, you're right. It's your mind that's to keep knowing, you know, remembering what it is to walk because you don't walk unless you're on the, you know, True. machines like that. So, um, that's not like the only things that we do while we're there. That was just there. That was what I did that day um, I plan on eventually showing you guys some more. Uh, so that's gonna be a big part of my videos um, you know keeping you guys updated on the progress that I'm making and um, Just showing you guys the milestones that I make uh, that I yeah that I get or what it's the milestone the milestones Let me say that and then um in between, you know, I'm gonna show you guys the daily life and not let this injury stop me from having any type of fun. Um, so thank you guys for watching the video. I appreciate it. I appreciate the views. Uh, if you haven't already, like and subscribe and please share the channel. Um, every all the support everyone has shown so far has been, you know, has been great um, and a lot more than I already expected. So I appreciate everyone, and I will see you guys in the next video.